Hello, welcome to our English lesson. Today, I, Perna Rasulova, a teacher of English at school number nine in the town of Ingiul, will tell you about a very beautiful celebration in England, May Day. Open your books on page 82 and find the topic. To make the lesson more understandable, let's start it with some grammar. Look at remember box. Apostrophes are punctuation marks that can show possession. This is an important lesson. Apostrophe S is for singular noun. S with apostrophe if more than one is found. For example, Mike's bike. Mike is one person. It is singular. The lady's cake. The man's boat. Renée's test. For singular nouns, apostrophe S may be found. More examples. The girl's room. There are many girls. This is plural. The boy's hut. The dog's park. The bee's hive. For plural nouns, S with apostrophe may be found. So, you see, it's very easy. And now, Look at the picture given in activity 2. Isn't it very beautiful? Shall we answer the questions? Question 1. What color are the girls' dresses? We can see that the dresses are colorful. Red, pink, yellow, blue. Question 2. What are the girls doing? Yes, sure. They are dancing. Question 3. What season is it? Look around. It's green everywhere. So it is spring. Question 4. What country is it? If you don't know the answer, we can find it in the following activity by reading the text and finding title to it. May Day is a holiday in England. On May Day, young people take flowers to their homes. They sing spring songs and choose a May King and May Queen. The May King and May Queen have beautiful spring flowers on their heads. Children dance round a maple with colored ribbons. The ribbons make a bright picture on maple. But not a lot of people do it now. Children, what do you think? What title is good for the text? I think the title is May Day in England. To consolidate our lesson, we shall do some activities. In this one, we must make pairs of words opposite in meaning. Let's begin. The opposite of gray is bright. The opposite of young is old, and the opposite of not a lot of is a lot of. The opposite of king is surely queen. Let's revise the words we have learned today with filling in the cluster. Find the words related to the topic May Day. Let's begin. Yes, dancing, maple. Young people, bright ribbon, queen, pink flowers, and crown. Open your copy books. Find activity 4, given on page 122. Here we must complete sentences using the new words. Let's do it together. On May Day. Young people pick what? Flowers and put them in where? Their homes. Children like to dance around a maple. The maple is bright.
You know, the first day of May is known as May Day. It is a time of year when warmer weather returns after the winter, and flowers and trees start to bloom again. It is said to be a time of love and romance. Although summer does not officially begin until June, May Day marks its beginning. May Day celebrations have been carried out in England for over two thousand years. May poles were once common all over England, and were kept from one year to the next. Schools would practice keeping around the pole for weeks. The end results. Would be beautiful plated pattern of a ribbon around the pole. Before 1500s, every village had a maple on the first May every year. The people decorated with ribbons and danced around it. In some villages, a girl is crowned as a May Queen. Just. Like this. The tallest maple is said to have been erected in London on Strand in 1661. It stood over 143 feet high. It was felled in 1717 when it was used by Isaac Newton to support Huygens' new reflected telescope. I have a nice rhyme for you. Repeat after me. May days here, May days here. Sun shines bright, sun shines bright. Birds and butterflies are in flight. Blooming flowers are such a sight. Everything feels just right. That is all I have for you today. And at home, I want you to look through the page, read the text, learn the new words, do activities one and two on page one hundred and twenty-two, and learn the rhyme. Thank you for your attention.